when it comes to the mountable dinosaur Yoshi, there's been more than a few hit games in his name. Welcome to WatchMojo.com, and today we'll be counting down our picks for the top 10 Yoshi video games. For this list, we're looking at the range of Yoshi-themed games that have found their way into the public consciousness and into our hearts. From straightforward platformers to gravity puzzle-based titles, and even the odd shooter, there's no shortage of proof that Mario's green, egg-spitting companion has endured throughout the years. <laughs> Number 10, Yoshi's New Island. A little of something new mixed in with classic elements. That's how the 3DS game Yoshi's New Island was built, relying on its series' established side-scrolling gameplay while offering fair tweaks to the well-worn formula. <laughs> this time around, Yoshi has access to a handful of new vehicle forms, controlled via a gyroscope, as well as collectible power-ups such as flutter wings and mega egg dozers for getting past obstacles. <laughs> Yet, New Island pays tribute to its roots via the inclusion of a hand-drawn art style and its focus on Yoshi's continued protection of Baby Mario. Number 9, Yoshi Topsy-Turvy. Also known as Yoshi's Universal Gravitation, this is an odd but endearing installment for the Yoshi series. Yoshi is tasked with venturing through the pages of a storybook in order to free his island from captivity, requiring him to complete challenges given to him by a series of obsessive spirits. In moment-to-moment -moment play, this translates into players making use of the game cartridge's tilt mechanic to rotate and progress across difficult-to-traverse areas. It makes for an interesting blend of problem-solving and clever platforming. Number 8, Yoshi's Cookie. Who doesn't like cookies? This tile matching game puts Yoshi in the position of having to clear a grid of cookies by lining up and matching cookie variants in rows. It's a simple enough concept, made more challenging by the increasing complexity of each level without compromising the sheer addictiveness of its core design. Further, the game includes a multiplayer versus mode, allowing two players to compete against each other in cookie clearing fun. If a bit simple, it's still a good time to be had by all. Number 7, Yoshi's Safari. Talk about breaking the mold in more ways than one. Released for the Super Nintendo in 1993, Yoshi's Safari plays out as a first-person rail shooter with Mario, on Yoshi's back, blasting away at King Bowser's minions. The game has players use the Super Scope gun peripheral to defeat foes, as well as having them command Yoshi to occasionally jump or head down branching paths offering differing rewards. To top it off, Yoshi's Safari even makes use of the SNES's Mode 7 processing for its backgrounds, adding to the bizarre yet remarkable nature of the game as a whole. Number 6, Yoshi's Story. Sometimes it's the slight shifts that make the difference. Case in point, the Nintendo 64 game Yoshi's Story relies on platforming gameplay set in the tone of its predecessors, yet tilts it in a more challenge-oriented direction. The game is built around improving the player's score, known in-game as Yoshi's Mood by eating fruit and defeating enemies in a strategic fashion. Thus, it encourages approaching levels in unique ways, like having Yoshi hop on foes instead of eating them. Add to that the game's use of pre-rendered 3D backgrounds for its levels, and you have a fascinating addition to the Yoshi franchise. Number 5, Yoshi's Island DS. Weeks and editions are the name of the game here. Acting as a mix of the visual style of DS era installments and the central platforming of the original Yoshi's Island, this nevertheless stands out as something kind of special. <laughs> 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 
Yoshi's Island DS again has the titular dinosaur working to save babies from the forces of evil. Except this time around, there are more children than just baby Mario in play. Yoshi gets powers from each of the five children, ranging from a dash move to a magnet that attracts metal objects. All of this works together to add puzzle aspects to the completion of the levels. Number 4. Yoshi Touch and Go Touch and Go brought our beloved dinosaur to the Nintendo DS, while stripping back the series' gameplay to its basics. Despite the player not having control of Yoshi's movements, the game still allows influence over Yoshi's path through levels via well-implemented use of the DS's touchscreen and microphone. Creating clouds to service platforms, getting rid of enemies by circling them, commanding Yoshi to fire eggs, it all contributes to the game feeling a lot more strategic than most. More than that though, the game reinforces player improvement through its use of a high score system and emphasis on replaying the core modes. Number 3. Tetris Attack Ah, more in the way of unusual spin-offs. Tetris Attack, the first game in the Puzzle League series, once more has Yoshi heading out to rescue the other inhabitants of Yoshi's Island. This entails a string of battles with Yoshi's friends and the minions of Bowser, taking the form of grid-based puzzles where the player must swap and rearrange blocks to win. The simplicity of the core gameplay is matched by its sheer degree of player satisfaction, further complemented by the game embracing the light-hearted visuals of the previous Yoshi titles. Yeah! Number 2. Yoshi's Woolly World The cuteness is calling to you, you just gotta let it in. Yoshi's Woolly World marks the return of the Yoshi franchise to home consoles after 17 years. And what a return it is. <laughs> This Wii U title draws visual inspiration from developer Goodfeel's 2010 game, Kirby's Epic Yarn, with Yoshi's famed island depicted as a vibrant blend of wool and cloth. Beyond the lively and lovable aesthetics though, Woolly World revives the collectible-based progression, flutter jumps, swallowing of enemies, and other series tropes with ease, giving the game a nostalgic charm. Number 1. Super Mario World 2 – Yoshi's Island The classics never die. Yoshi's Island acts as a prequel to Super Mario World, depicting Yoshi as a guardian of baby Mario, amid a quest to rescue Mario's brother Luigi from the young Bowser's clutches. <laughs> to that end, Yoshi and the player must run and jump through 48 levels, stylized in a hand-drawn manner that gave the game as a whole a fairy tale feel. From the soundtrack's mix of epic and fanciful motifs to the multitude of secrets and hidden areas to find, it all comes together to form one heartwarming package. Do you agree with our list? What's your favorite Yoshi game? Yoshi. For more dinosaur centric top 10s published every day, be sure to subscribe to WatchMojo.com. Thank <laughs> you.